Today is May the 25th, 2024. This is Carmen bringing you your daily Bloodborne Remaster update. No news on a Bloodborne Remaster today, but we're going to see if I can remember everything I need to mention for gaming news. I've had a few drinks tonight, so let's hope I can get it all in order. So, first of all, the next Doom game is Doom the Dark Ages. Uh, very interested to see what this will be. It's supposed to have a very medieval take on Doom, as the name suggests. This could be very, very cool. It's going to be shown at the Xbox Game Showcase, and according to Jess Corden, it is also going multi-plat. This made a ton of sense because I would say... Mm, I'd say it was probably an even split between PC and uh, PlayStation for Doom's fan base, and then whatever little bit was left was probably on Xbox, so it makes a lot of sense not to cut uh, PlayStation out of the pie here. So, thank you, Axel. I definitely agree with the decision to make it multi-plat. Very good decision by id Software. One, Thank you, Axel. One second, we're multitasking here, because Axel is a menace. <laughs> Anyways, so yeah. I agree with the decision to go multi-plat for that. Very good. Xbox Game Showcase is coming up. Jess Corden has a lot of things he predicts. Fable, Perfect Dark, Avowed, stuff like that. Very neat. Uh, let's see here. PlayStation event. We don't know if it's a showcase or a state of play, but a PlayStation event is still set for this month, according to Jeff Grubb. So this week, this coming up week, <laughs> is the last little bit of time it has. So we're going to see what comes of it. Kingdom Hearts is almost definitely getting a showing at the Summer Jeff Fest. Too much news about it. It was a long dry spell, and now we've got news at the Wazoo, okay? Kingdom Hearts is getting a trailer at the Summer Jeff Fest, and I personally cannot wait to see it. So, I don't think I forgot anything else. Uh, let's see. Oh, Shadow of the Earth Tree is coming up, but that's, that's besides the point. Um, yeah, I think that's about it. So, Doom, Xbox, Expectations, Kingdom Hearts... Uh, Stellar Blade got an update that like uncensored a couple of the outfits. I'll play Stellar Blade soon. I was going to buy it uh, this weekend, but then I had to spend $80 on a new PS5 controller. So, uh, yeah, that didn't happen. Uh, but I did buy Bayonetta, so that's cool. <laughs> Anyways, I'm going to go ahead and get out of here. Uh, no news on a Bloodborne remaster today. That has been your daily Bloodborne remaster update for May the 25th, 2024.